in last video we have configured our uh, our catkin workspace in this video we will add our uh, robotarm package to this uh, workspace and configure it for a raw simulation so uh, these are the commands we use for uh, creating our catkin workspace you will find this document in the description of this video so next step is to copy the uh, ROS package folder to your catkin workspace uh, you need to copy it in the src folder of your catkin workspace so i will go on my desktop here i have copied the uh, folder uh, generated from solidworks i will copy it you don't need uh, you should not rename it otherwise it will not work so you should go into your src folder of your catkin workspace and paste it here next we need to uh, configure some files in this uh, uh, urda package before building our catkin workspace so you can find the details in the document first thing is we need to edit this uh, cmake list txt file uh, which you will find the catkin workspace here cmake list.txt the file uh, contains uh, like uh, this information about like uh, how to build your package what are the dependencies so <clears throat> You will find this find package section empty and the catkin package uh, section empty we need to add some uh, dependencies like uh, on which uh, packages are required for this and the catkin packages it depends on okay so first of all go to your catkin workspace and open this file in the text editor so <clears throat> sorry uh, open the uh, file here you will find this green color code which is not available in the file you just uh, cop select it and copy it using ctrl c uh, go to the file click here press enter times and uh, go here and uh, do ctrl v we have uh, added it you can just uh, make some changes like uh, just to make it uh, easy readable you can add some indentation And next we need to add this uh, catkin dependencies copy this go to your catkin path uh, the cmake list.txt file go here press enter twice come here control p like this we just uh, to make it uh, easy readable so we are done we have added, uh, we have added all the uh, lines we want to add so save it and uh, close it if you make any uh, mistakes in this you will get some error while building your package so next we need to edit the uh, package.xml file which is also in your uh, package folder here package.xml you just need to open it again in the text editor i think here uh, zooming is not possible but uh, uh, this contains the uh, package uh, format like the uh, package format the name of the package the version the description like uh, solidworks uh, the plugin added the uh, some comments here the next is like uh, the author you can add your uh, author name I will add my name uh, here uh, you can add your email address you can add your real email address but i will add my dummy like uh, dummy and here okay so once you are done with this like you need to keep the license address it is the bsd1 uh, press enter the next uh, we need to add some more dependencies like here uh, some uh, this uh, solidworks to urdf plugin has already added some dependencies but uh, we need to add some more so go to the pdf you can just uh, see it uh, side by side for uh, easy viewing so here you can see like we have this part already available here uh, so next 
in uh, depends like uh, depend uh, tags here you can find like uh, some of them are available but we will just uh, copy all of this and uh, it is like you need to copy this and you need to add it before this uh, depend tags Uh, it is not mandatory to uh, follow the uh, like uh, indentation but uh, it is good to make habit to indent your code properly so that uh, it will be easy readable okay so then you need to like here some dependencies depend tags are already available with some package names just need to add these uh, green lines uh, additionally to it it is not mandatory to follow the sequence uh, similar to mine but uh, I will do it as it is. And then this part is completely missing in the default uh, package.xml. So I will just uh, copy it, just uh, go below it and uh, paste it here. You can keep it as it is also, but I will add some spaces at the starting, just uh, indent it properly. Now save your uh, package.xml file. Again, if you make any uh, spelling mistake or typing mistake here, it will give you the error while uh, building your package. So close this. Again, we will come back to our document. So next, uh, we need to edit our URDF file. So uh, we'll uh, do it in a next video because this will become very long video. So stay tuned and watch my next video. Thank you.